what's up? Uh, welcome to another golf clinic with Lamar Mon. That's me back at Ann Morrison this year, and uh, this is hole 15. You can kind of see it out here. Uh, it's one of the longer holes at Ann Morrison, and uh, it, it's a great day to work on a roller shot. Uh, the grass is a little damp, which I like it to be a little damp. I don't like it to be dry. I like a little bit of a challenge, like most people. So come on over here. Uh, when setting up your shot for a roller, there, there's a lot to think about. And rollers are way different, way different than any other shot because they don't, they don't fly, can you, can you get that? They don't fly straight like this. Um, what they do is, is exactly as it sounds. They, they flip over and they, they roll. And the, the point is, is to get the disc to roll as far as you can and as straight as you can. That's the idea. So there's lots of different ways to throw ro th uh, roller. Excuse me. You can use like the, the, hammer, the hammer head. You could do the hammer head roller or you could do the, the Granada, uh, Granada, which is, I believe it's, uh, I believe it's Spanish for grenade. Um, also known as a tomahawk. So, it, you know, kind of the, oh, it's self-explanatory, that motion. But what I like to do is, it's a little move called the bowling cue roll. And it, it's taken me a lot, a lot of time to master, but the first thing you really want to think about is surface area of a disc. Because if you have a fatter surface, you're going to have a lot more control and you're going to have a lot less roll time because of traction um, because of traction in the ground and well things on the ground so what I like to use for my rollers for the most distance is the Anova XD DX plastic I use DX mostly because it's really durable and it's it's a straight shooter they don't lie to you um, at all uh, and I I just like honest discs so first things first they, I, what I'm trying to do now this limbs high so I'm thinking man my shot is gonna be right into that limb and if I flick well there's a water hazard right here so the best shot it's about 350 feet to the basket so I'm gonna try my boiling skew roll um, and, and what you need to do for that, it's it's a lot like it's a lot like setting up uh, setting up to sit down. Um, you kind of push down like this. Uh, I've done a lot of yoga, so it's easier for me to really get this kind of position going on. But this is how you aim, um, and, and it, you want it to roll left. What you're going to do is, is steer the disc like a car. You're gonna I want it to go left, so I'm going to aim this way, get nice and straight, and then I'm going to over that way because that's the way I want the disc to go and to get the most roll out of here it's really good to to spin so let me start over again here's your marker it's in play okay you got that right so you're gonna want to give yourself about five six feet to go and then and then you fucking just yeah, hook it you know uh, it takes a lot of practice but Look, if you give up, are you really going to get anywhere with this game? Just answer that yourself and maybe write a little essay on how you can improve your game and read it in a couple weeks and see what you've learned, okay? That's one thing I recommend. All right, let's do this. 